Hello guys, my name is Lorena. I'm one of the co-founders of Blogettes and today I'm going to talk to you about the Google Keyword Finder. Through our workshops and many webinars, we always get asked how should I title my post, how do I know what keyword to use, and it's very, very important, especially for all of you guys that are just noticing that all your traffic comes from social networks. It's important for you to pay attention to your content and understand that yes, your site needs to be SEO optimized, but also when you optimize your content, you'll see great results. So today we're not gonna talk about the full optimization of the content, but we're gonna talk about how just understanding what keywords you can use and understanding how, how people are Googling those terms can really help your organic traffic. So we're gonna go ahead and log in into the Google Keyword Planner tool, you're gonna need to have a Google AdWords account. That's very, very simple to use. Just go into Google AdWords and just your, use your Gmail and your password and you'll automatically have a Google AdWords account. So once you have that, you're gonna go here on my screen, you'll be able to see, you're, here you're logged in into AdWords and you'll go into um, Tools and under Tools, you'll be able to find the Keyword Planner. So once you're here, we're here on the Keyword Planner, what you're gonna do is go into here, find new keywords, search for new keywords, and you're gonna start searching for, for example, if you're gonna write a post about the benefits of kale, right? Kale right now is so popular, so let's say you are blogging about healthy food and you wanna know how to better title a post that you're writing about kale. So you're gonna go into here and you're gonna say um, benefits of kale. So once you type it here, you're gonna go, you could also use your landing page, which we're gonna do later, or your product or category. But for now, we're just gonna leave benefits of kale and you can, you can geo-target. So where are you interested? Where, where are most of your readers? So for now, we're gonna leave it in the United States. You could change the language and here on the search engines, which is Google, right? So you could go into a little bit more detail here too, into the keyword filters. So in case you didn't want to see any results with a less than certain number of people Googling it a month, but for now we're just gonna do benefits of kale and we're gonna click on get ideas. So here it's loading, but it's very important for you to do this so you can understand how people are Googling for the content that you're writing, right? And even before you do this, before you title a post, you should be able to ask yourself, how would I Google this? And that will give you a better idea as well. So now that you're here, you're gonna click on the tab that says keyword ideas. And you'll be able to see that a lot of people are actually typing the health benefits of kale. So here you'll be able to determine Okay, maybe it's better for you if you name your posts the health benefits of, what are the health benefits of kale? And that will get you, at least you can see here, that it has a lot of monthly searches compared to just benefits of eating kale. So now I know that if I, under my title, use the phrase health benefits for kale, I'll get much better results. And if I mention that, so for SEO, you would mention health benefits of kale in the title, and then you would mention that same phrase in your content a couple of times smartly throughout your content, right? So all of a sudden, I went from just calling a post the benefits of kale to what are the health benefits of kale, and I have improved my chances of my content being found organically. Here, you can also take a look at, and don't, don't worry about the word you see here about the suggested beat or all of that. These are just in case you want to run AdWords campaigns, but we're just right now using the tool for research. You can see all of the different ideas and the different keywords that you can use. So pay attention to that. And then also what you can do here is um, you can we can go back to where we were in the beginning and we're gonna get rid of benefits of kale and what you can do here is enter your product category so for example for blogettes it would be blogging and it will be blogging resources and services and i want google to let me know what kind of keywords i should be using throughout my articles and throughout my content so people could find me 
So I'm gonna do blogging resources and services and then get ideas. And here we're gonna go again, it's loading. But here we are on the keyword idea, so of course I should be using the word blogger, uh, blogs, um, Pinterest, and then blogging. So here you can get an idea of what people are actually looking for. Something else that you need to take a look at is we're going to go ahead and say benefits of kale again and we're going to get ideas. Um, here, when you go into your keyword ideas, um, you'll be able to see that the search term here, it's the exact search term that I'm looking for. So the benefits of kale has an average monthly searches of 12,100 and the competition is really, it's low. So that's good because you're looking for high volume with low competition. So, and then here, keywords by relevance, these are just some ideas that Google is giving you guys. So health benefits of kale has 4,400 and here kale benefits has 8,100. So here you'll be able to get other ideas, but just understand that here it's the exact thing that you were looking for and the ones underneath are just related ideas. So guys, what you're looking for is for keywords or phrases like we're doing right now that have high search volumes and low competition because that means that there's not a lot of people there targeting those but at the same time there's a lot of people actually looking for them so this is just a little bit about the keyword tool so I hope you really use it to your advantage and start optimizing your content and your titles and you'll see a big big difference in your organic traffic if you have any other questions just send us an email at info at blog and subscribe to our channel and thank you so much for being part of this video thank you